Oh, the final race of the week then is the Val Standard Distance Handicap. It's a one mile six furlong walk to 80. Um, the top one is Puissance Colours for Alex Cherry, Lisboa, Darren Thompson, Royal Blue Mile to lead them, Kothar Winch for Hims, Captivity Balafre for T Rogers, Column Seal Dark, Steve Ran Plan Incoming, Mark Jones and Jezza Loin for Derek Hinton. So, all installed then. And away they go. And the final race of the shortest flat week of the season. Only 35 races this week for some reason. And Puissance Colours is the early leader. With Kofar Winch and Jezza Loin second and third. They're sorting themselves out now. And one and three quarters on the all weather. And Puissance Colours is a couple of lengths to the good from Jezza Loin in the pink jacket. And the green jacketed Kofar Winch with a white cap. The rest of them are pretty tightly packed with. Captivity Balafre, probably just a back marker on the outside, difficult to tell from the angle. And Puissance Colours is clear though by a good four. As they make their way towards the final mile and a quarter. And Puissance Colours for Alex Cherry in the lead from Kothar Winch in second. Jezzaline third, Lisboa four, and Captivity Balafre on the outside, Royal Blue. And the purple jacket is next in column seal dark and the pink cap on the inside and the back marker is just plan in coming in the black jacket police on colors set at a decent sort of pace they're already down towards the final mile then police on colors leads by four or five the rest of them pretty tightly packed with column seal dark and plan in coming just detached a little bit at the back but plenty close enough to play a part in the finish of this race yet. Puissance Colours in the lead. With Kothar went second. Royal Blue is now poked through into third. Then Captivity Balafre. Jezza Loin just jockey just up in the irons a little bit there. Looking for room. And his Boa is next. Then Cotton Seal Dark and Plan in coming. The lead for Puissance Colours is down to a couple of lengths. I think Puissance Colours will be a horse jumping over fences, won't they? Really? in the lead in this long distance flat race with just over four and a half furlongs to go and Puissance Colours it is who is in the lead still from Kothar Wench in second then Jezza Loin for Hollywood Hinton on the inside making a forward move there Captivity Balafra and, Thomas, and um, Column Seal Dark as they race down towards the three furlong pole and Puissance Colours still in the lead Column Seal Dark looks to be going particularly well though doesn't it Royal Blues dropped right out of it and it's Puissance Colours in the lead from Column Seal Dark now throwing down a big challenge on the outside as they come down Towards the two furlong pole. Puissance Colors has been in the lead all the way, but he's now being pressed by Column Seal Dark. Then comes Jezza Lorne and Captain Balafre. Kofar Wench and Planning coming after that one, but now the leader's being collared by Column Seal Dark on the outside. Column Seal Dark pokes his head in front there, past the furlong pole there, and it's Column Seal Dark in the lead. But here come Captivity Balafre and Planning coming, and now Puissance Colors is getting back up again. It's Puissance Colors on the inside as they race towards the line now, but Captivity Balafre is going to get up and take it, and Captivity Balafre wins it. Puissance Colors is second then. Column Seal Dark and Miss Boa and Planning coming after that one. Jezza Loin might have dropped out to be last, but it was Captivity Malafre who came through. Oh, oh, Column Seal Dark had got that one, but that one just hit the wall, didn't it? And Puissance Colors battled back for second. But Captivity Malafre is the winner. Let's get a look at the full thing. It's, it's T Rogers again, so he's had a really good start. Captivity Malafre. He's the winner. Puissance Colours for Alex Cherry second. Column Seal Dark for Steve Ram third. Liz Boa for Darren Thompson fourth. And Plan Incoming for Mark Jones was fifth. And we'll be back next week.